Hey, how's it going? Andy here, back with another pickup video. Uh, I just want to say the last week and a half, two weeks of thrifting has been relatively slow, so I haven't picked up too much stuff, but I did get some cool stuff as always, so let's just jump into it. Alright, starting things off, I was at Walmart Christmas shopping, trying to get everything done super early, which I'm basically done, which is awesome. I only have like three more things I gotta get, which is very, very exciting. But while I was there, I was looking at stuff for myself, saw this awesome shirt for like 7 or $8, I had to get it. And that is this Dragon Ball Z shirt. So it has Ginyu Force and it has Z some of the Z Fighters on it. How to get it. So eight, there's like seven or eight dollars. Why not? So normally I would separate everything, like all the movies go together, all the games go together, but since I don't have that much stuff, I'm just gonna go bag by bag. So the first bag is mainly uh Cybertron and some Goodwill stuff. Then the rest is Goodwill and Boys and Girls Club. So let's just jump into it. So I'm not sure if I showed this off um last week. I'm pretty sure I did, but I'm just gonna show it off again. I uh, got Super Mario Sunshine for the Wii, which, like I said, I'm pretty sure I already showed you guys this, but I just wasn't sure, so I'm not going to go into much detail, but uh, I did pick up two sets of nunchucks and Wiimotes, so I only have one Wiimote over here with me at the moment, but they're a little dirty, uh, definitely, like, if you look, I don't know if my camera will focus, like, this D-pad is super dirty. Just, eh, whatever. Uh, I just needed these for the Wii. This way I can navigate to play my GameCube games. So, like I said, I got two sets. Uh, other Wiimote is somewhere. So, also, I got a sensor bar and component cables, which is awesome. Um, and I also picked up a black GameCube controller. This was, like, 20 bucks, but when I picked this up, it was... Buy one use accessory or game and get one use accessory or game half off. So that was cool. Paid 20 bucks for this. Then I got Super Smash Bros. Brawl because why not? Uh, it was 50% off. They were like, hey, we're going to give you 50% off of this. So I only ended up paying $13, $14 for it. So I'm okay with that. It's a... Uh, my receipt, don't want you guys seeing that. 100% complete. The game is in there, in, in my Wii. So, <laughs> I was playing that. So it's, it's a fun game. I, I really do enjoy it. Doing pretty well, not gonna lie. Uh, I mainly also bought that just to play it, because I've never played it. And the new Smash is coming out in like a week. So, a week. A month. <laughs> so, I'm pretty excited for that. Next up, I got Sonic Mania Plus. Uh, I've been meaning to pick this game up. I just haven't for whatever reason. I was just going to download it for the Switch. I just, I don't know. Uh, I saw this at Cybertron. It was $30. I was like, yeah, why not? So, it comes with a little book. So, why not? Then, last but not least from Cybertron, I picked up two NES games that I'm very, very excited about. The first game is Bugs Bunny Birthday Blowout. Now, I had this game. I got it in that big NES lot that I got from my friend, which card is going to pop up. You guys check that out. But uh, when I got rid of a lot of those games because I was moving, I was like, I'm not keeping all these. I ended up getting rid of this one. And I kind of regret it because it's actually a pretty fun game. So it's a just a platforming game, but I really enjoyed it. Then this NES game is one I've been trying to get forever and ever. But ever, ever. I've lost so many bids on eBay for it. Even complete copies. I was actually, it was like two weeks ago, I was betting on a copy of it. I just didn't win. It sold for like 20, 25 bucks, something like that. And that is Double Dare, which you guys have seen me play. Thought I had a burp. <laughs> which you guys have seen me play on my live streams. It's just a really fun, super simple game. Very underrated. Uh, it was only $13. So that's one of the main reasons why I got it. But yeah, it, it's basically, it's the show. <laughs> In a NES game. Really fun. I just really enjoy it. 
Next up is some more Goodwill stuff. So, like I said, not too much. But, uh, speaking of Nickelodeon game shows, I got, well, you can already see it, Legends of the Hidden Temple game. Uh, I've been actually wanting to buy this. It's, you can get it at Target. It's like 20 bucks. That's why I haven't picked it up. I uh, got it for three. So, I don't know how well we'll be able to see. But, three dollars. Not bad. Um, yeah, I don't know. It, it's Legends of the Hidden Temple. You gotta love it. It's, it's a great game. Now, I've actually never played that board game, but the actual show is great. But next up, we got uh, what is this? Tower of Terror. So, saw that. It was half off, so I picked it up. Um, let's go with another VHS. We got Sewer Heroes 2 TMNT. I love TMNT. This is about an hour long, so pretty dope. Plus, that FHE. Logo is always good. That's like super nostalgic for me. Also got a couple games. Nothing too crazy, but they're cheap and games I didn't have. Like this, Resident Evil 6 for the 360. Never played it. Uh, I heard it was eh. But this one has... If I can take that. Uh, both discs. So it's a little two disc thing. I don't know. It was $3, so pick that up. Then, I saw this because it was a game, basically, when I'm at Goodwill, if I see, like, a Wii game, or just a game I normally don't see all the time, like, Just Dance, or, like, Madden, or something, I always try to pick it up because it's different, and that is Counter Force. Now, unfortunately, I looked up reviews, and it said it wasn't that good, but it's like a... It's like a 3D slash 2D shooter. It's it's 3D, but it's in the style of like a 2D shooter. So I don't know. It might be good. Okay, right, so this is the last bag. It's just some VHSs that I got from uh, Boys and Girls Club. I actually got them today as a filming. Nothing too crazy, but we got the classic jingle all the way. Uh, I already have it, but I mainly got it because I want to get six. So, it's a, it's clamshell, which is nice. So, it's a weird clamshell. I don't know. There's, they're, they're having a deal where they're like 35% off. So, got that. Got this because it looked cool. Uh, Dinosaurs of the Jurassic. So, pretty awesome. Action pack claymation. Oh, that's cool. I didn't realize that. So, uh, that's pretty awesome. Also, made in the USA because of course it is. Then I got Mulan because I actually don't have it. And I've only seen this a couple times. I thought it was all right. This was somebody's at one point. And like you guys know, I like kids cartoons. So I got Dragon Tales. I like Dragon Tales. I've, I've already explained that. Now, this was actually kind of interesting. Harry Potter, the unauthorized story of J.K. Rowling. Never heard of it. Um, came out in... Doesn't say. Does not say. But I saw it, and I was like, that's very interesting. So I went and picked that up. Last but not least, we got something pretty interesting. And that is Charles Chaplin and the Great Dictator. Right, dictator. Yeah. So this is uh that Char Charlie Chaplin Hitler film. Hitler film. Um, it's supposed to be actually really good. It's black and white. It's old school. They actually had. Oh, this is only part two. That explains why there was two copies of it. I probably should have looked at that. Oh well, doesn't matter. We got part two. Uh, it doesn't say part two anywhere on this. Interesting. Well, they still have it, so I'll, I'll just go back and buy part one, I guess. Hopefully it's part one. Yeah, I probably should have looked. It just says part two. Oh, well, the more you know. Well, guys, that's going to do it for the pickups. What did you get this week? Let me know in the comments down below. With that being said, you guys rock. Stay rad. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.